Hi, I'm mom. Hey, I'm daughter. Lizzo is facing a lawsuit against her three former dancers. They are accusing the singer of S harassment and creating a hostile work environment. Lizzo is also being accused of pressuring and weight shaming her former dancers. Filmmaker Sophia Nolly Allison spoke out about the allegations made against Lizzo. In 2019, Sophia no longer worked as a director on Lizzo's documentary because she was treated with disrespect. Here's what Sophia posted on her Instagram story. I usually do not comment on anything pop culture related, but in 2019, I traveled a bit with Lizzo to be the director of her documentary. I walked away after about two weeks. I was treated with such disrespect by her. I witnessed how arrogant, self-centered, and unkind she is. I was not protected and was thrown into a situation with little support. My spirit said to run as fast as you can and I'm so grateful I trusted my gut. I felt gaslit and was deeply hurt, but I've healed. Reading these reports made me realize how dangerous of a situation it was. This kind of abuse of power happens far too often. Much love and support to the dancers. Someone named Charlene was a part of that documentary. Charlene says Sophia is telling the truth. I was part of this documentary with, at your girl, Sophia. This is all true. I had to vent to so many of my friends about it. It was such a small crew and the experience of working with Lizzo was a nightmare. Sophia posted something else on her Instagram story. To be clear, since I've spoken out, I've had others privately share their very similar experiences, and I have also been affirmed by people who witnessed what I went through. Lizzo creates an extremely toxic and hostile working environment and undermines the work, labor, and authority of other black and brown women in the process. Notice how the documentary ended up being directed by a CIS white man. She is a narcissistic bully and has built her brand off of lies. I was excited to support and protect a black woman through the documentary process, but quickly learned her image and message was a curated facade. I stand with the dancers and anyone who has had similar experiences working with her and her team. These working conditions are not okay. Lizzo posted her statement on Instagram. Lizzo is denying the allegations. These last few days have been gut-wrenchingly difficult and overwhelmingly disappointing. My work ethic, morals, and respectfulness have been questioned. My character has been criticized. Usually, I choose not to respond to false allegations, but these are as unbelievable as they sound and too outrageous to not be addressed. These sensationalized stories are coming from former employees who have already publicly admitted that they were told their behavior on tour was inappropriate and unprofessional. As an artist, I have always been very passionate about what I do. I take my music and my performances seriously because at the end of the day, I only want to put out the best art that represents me and my fans. With passion comes hard work and high standards. Sometimes I have to make hard decisions, but it's never my intention to make anyone feel uncomfortable or like they aren't valued as an important part of the team. I am not here to be looked at as a victim, but I also know that I am not the villain that people in the media have portrayed me to be these last few days. I am very open with my sexuality and expressing myself, but I cannot accept or allow people to use that openness to make me out to be something I am not. There is nothing I take more seriously than the respect we deserve as women in the world. I know what it feels like to be body shamed on a daily basis and would absolutely never criticize or terminate an employee because of their weight. I'm hurt, but I will not let the good work love done in the world be overshadowed by this. I want to thank everyone who has reached out in support to lift me up during this difficult time. Kahana Montrese is a drag performer most known for competing on season 11 of RuPaul's Drag Race. Kahana Montrese commented on Lizzo's Instagram post, as someone who has actually worked with you and your crew, I can say Lizzo has created one of the most uplifting, fun, diverse, and supportive shows I've ever been a part of. Every single person dancer, stage crew, and manager was so excited to be a part of the show because it honestly starts with Lizzo. She was so encouraging to every one of her dancers and guests she had. She really made me feel so special to be a part of her team and we had so many different types of queens. From different sizes to different culture backgrounds and every one of us felt loved and supported being on tour with her. Please don't let this define you Lizzo. I will never forget how special you made us all feel working with you. Do you think these allegations are true or false? Comment your thoughts. Please subscribe and share this video with others. Thank you like mom and daughter.